Hi, this is Trailers from Hell. I'm George Hickenlooper, and you are about to see a trailer from one of the most psychologically claustrophobic, terrifying films of all time. One of my top ten personal favorites of all time, Night of the Living Dead. And here it is. Welcome. Wow, there's so much to say about this picture. What I will say is it affected me on such a primal level when I saw it. I, I, I first saw it on uh, Creature Features, which was a, a local Bay Area, San Francisco, Saturday night horror television show hosted by Bob Wilkins. And um, I was about seven or eight years old, and the film just gave me nightmares and actually continues to give me nightmares to this day as a 42-year-old man. Um, there's something so claustrophobic and psychologically horrifying about this picture. It, it works um, on such a deep psychological level for me that it accomplishes what I think emotionally what film does at its essence, and that is it, it moves us, um, terrifies us, and just affects us in such a deep primordial level. This film continues to give me the chills, and because it affected me in such an emotional way, I, I keep it in my personal top ten favorites. I, you know, I, I register films not so much uh, on their aesthetic quality, but sort of how they affect me emotionally. This picture, um, just, uh, just watching the trailer, I couldn't even watch the trailer before I came here, it just gives me the willies. I don't know, I, I know I sound like probably a, a sissy, but it's very much a profound film. And I had the good fortune of interviewing George Romero 20 years ago for my book about the picture, and um, was very impressed. It, uh, also, the film works on a political level, you know, they talk about uh, the African American actor and how, you know, he's the sole survivor and he gets shot at the end. Romero always claimed that was by accident. He just thought he was a cool actor, but for me, the movie works on uh, on on a, on a political level as well as a visceral level, and all around, I just uh, I love this picture of the living dead.